All right, guys, it feels like today's gonna be a very long day. I have three installs to do. It's not on my car, it's actually on this 3.7 right here. Just wanted to bring you guys along during the install. One of my brother's friends hit me up and was like, hey man, I have uh, these things that I bought off of eBay. I saw one of your videos and I decided to pull the trigger and I bought it. So he did buy the diffuser from eBay, the front splitter and the tail light tint, as you can see right here. I just already started doing like a mock-up uh, install. Uh, you can, the uh, tip's falling off there, but I, I'm holding up with a speaker and I do have the bolts already ready to install. This just helps me um, align it better. Just with the tipster, I can just uh, drill the holes in, put the bolts in and it's good to go. So the diffuse is gonna be the easiest one. The tail light tint takes me about 45 minutes to maybe an hour just because I have to be using the heat gun and just readjusting all the tints. Front splitter is the one's gonna be a pain in my rear because there's so many bolts down there. I had to take the belly pan or the oil pan off as well. Then I have to drill holes because they don't come pre-drilled. So it's, it's the ones, that one's gonna take me maybe about an hour, an hour and a half. So I'm probably gonna be taking about three hours on this install. But as you can see guys, it's just the base V6. He does have the Shelby spoiler on nothing else and oh some louvers i do have a quick backstory guys this car got kind of wrecked or side swiped pretty badly on this side and it all happened the day that i sold him my wheels i don't know if you guys remember but i did have those black five spoke niche wheels i actually sold him my wheels and that same day guys i never talked about it um and it was kind of crazy that same day that i sold him the wheels he drove home and some car hit him they bent the one of the rear wheels so he has three insurance just um gave him some money for the wheel because for some reason those wheels got discontinued so there's no way of them replacing it for him so he's currently on those stock wheels so he's on the lookout for those niche i think they were gt5 wheels if not uh i don't know what he's gonna do maybe try to get it fixed but that sucks man those circumstances are horrible when that happens but just gonna bring you guys along the experience i've already done this install i have some videos on it but uh just, just let's just see a before and after on the car. The rear is officially finished, as you guys can see. Damn, I'm telling you, man, you guys are sleeping on this eBay diffuser. If you guys haven't gotten it yet, go ahead and pick it up. I think it's like 160 to 180 bucks. Just go pick it up. It makes a big difference for the base V6 Mustangs. And then the front, check out the front. We already started working on it. I got this half already bolted down. This one has like one or two bolts, but compared to the stock one, this is way, way better. So all I'm working right now is just bolting all these guys onto the bottom of the bumper. That way it's stuck on for sure. I had to make new holes. Obviously, like I said, these don't come with pre-drilled. So that's the only tough part. And then the next part is going to be just installing that belly pan back. And we should be good to go. Just going to make sure everything is bolted on properly. Because again, this isn't my car, so I wouldn't want something to happen on the highway or something where a splitter comes off. You still need to do this part right here but it should take me a couple of minutes and we're good. Officially finished with the rear and the front. You can see it's on there, man. It ain't going anywhere. Looks so, so much better. All it needs are those wheels, man. And he just told me that they actually are getting repaired already. So he should be getting them tomorrow. So it's gonna pair up really nicely with the front and the rear diffuser that front splitter with those black wheels i told them after those wheels man you're gonna need a drop for sure and your car is gonna be looking like a1 sauce man but it looks really good man he has those rear louver i mean he has window louvers the rear diffuser that gt500 uh track spoiler and that new ebay icon motorsports front splitter and it looks really good he does have some tail light tin for me to install i don't know if i'm gonna do it it is getting pretty hot and i'm running out of shade i might do it i might not maybe a, as a as the day goes on, it gets a little bit more darker, a little bit more cooler outside. It is about 100 degrees outside. But nonetheless, looks really good. I'm just going to go ahead and ask him to see 
um, what he thinks of it, what, what he thinks about the job, is it good? And let's see his reaction. Subscribe mm. Fence Gaming. Merry Christmas. Man, I just need the rims. What do you think, man? It's good? Yeah, it's really good. Now I need to. That front is huge. Yeah, the gap in the front. Look at this guy, dude. He's wearing a Hellcat cap. Oh, he has a Mustang. Bro. Please. I work at I work at Burns Motors if you ever want to get a free oil change. Free? No, not free. <laughs> Everybody's going to hit up the shop, dude. Yeah, yeah. um, I'll, I'll see what I'll do the toilet. I don't know if I'm running out of shade. Not yet. So. But there she is, man. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. There's a small probability they might fall off, but. Everything but V8s. We're good. Yeah, you're good. Yeah. When you get a modular car, dude. This guy do put the side scoops. We got four cylinders and V6. Yeah, yeah we've got a four cylinder V8, V8. V6, four cylinder, and my V6 is in here right now. But everything but V8s. Completely finished. Look at that. <laughs> Disregard that they were messing around with that. Um, looks pretty good. Honestly, it looks pretty good. Just with a few things, I think what two hundred dollars can can do to your car, guys. You got the tint on. Obviously, you got it installed. Looks really good. With the diffuser, it's not lowered yet, but that diffuser makes the car look a little bit lower in the rear and adds just like that contrast to the silver and black. He's getting his wheels tomorrow, and he has that diffuser now in the front. Pretty much gonna be almost a replica of my sister's car with those eBay parts, but. Nonetheless, looks really, really good. He's gonna scrape you. Let's go. There. The car coming. Oh, wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. The car coming. Looks way, way, way better. I don't know if I should buy it. Dang. So I'm filming this video a few days after everything was shot and as you all saw my my brother's friends finally got I guess they're my friends I can call them my friends now too I didn't consider them too much friends because they were still in high school but they are two years out of high school so I guess I consider them my friends now and I mean they've been hanging around for a while so they finally got the wheels on and those were the wheels I had before the niche no, not Mitch Milan the niche GT5s I believe and oh, I really missed those wheels a lot of people didn't really dig them on my car but honestly guys I really, really like them. Maybe I think I even like them more than my wheels, but the bronze just hit the spot for me. But anyways, that's gonna wrap it up. Just wanted to bring you guys with me as I installed the rear diffuser, the front splitter, all from eBay. I'm telling you guys, don't sleep on them because prices are gonna start getting jacked up sooner or later because everybody's gonna wanna get them. And a quick disclaimer, that rear diffuser is only for 15 through 17 Mustangs, guys. Uh, base Mustangs, not the premium ones. If you have the premium ones, I believe there's another diffuser for premium uh, Mustangs, but this, the one I have here, the one that we installed, uh, the one I provided a link before is for the base model and 18 through 20 or 18 and up it will not fit as well because they have a different rear bumper so just quick disclaimer because I have had a few people message me and ask me about that so just go ahead and do your research before make sure you read the description before you purchase anything guys but I'll catch you guys on the next one God bless <laughs>